I don't mean to take away from the game, but it, it is just another game of footy. And it, if I happen to debut, then it's my debut. But uh, I don't want to, I don't want to overthink it too much because that's when the nerves will get the best of you. Um, I'm pretty nervous, but hopefully I can transfer those nerves into the positive ones. I know probably my first possession might be a bit fumbly, but that's fine. I, I, I need to tell myself that's all right. Um, you know, it'd be nice to get the sting out of the ball a little bit. And I think then it'll probably flow a little bit easier. Um, it's pretty bizarre to think that a year ago from t on Friday, I was in the stands at Icon Park to now I potentially could be on the field running amok. I think um, that point when I saw that game, that probably was another stepping stone for me choosing football um, to see how much support we, we had or the girls had at that time. And um, yeah, it was, it, to me, that was my future there. And um, that was a, a massive part in my decision of coming to football. But the senior guys have been good. Like they, they do have that experience from last, last year's game mm -hmm. um, and they've transferred that into training. Like we've trained with loud noises. We've been told what to expect. Um, so I think the senior girls are really well prepared. The, the girls that will debut on the game and yeah, they're, they're just always checking on up on you and really genuinely care about how you're feeling and want, want the best for the team and yourself. It's exciting. I think after seeing what we accomplished last year and seeing just how big that first game was and what it meant for women in footy, to know that a year later it's still just as big and just as exciting for the entire football community, community let alone just the girls here, it's pretty exciting to know that we're still making such a big impact. I think a lot has changed but a lot stayed the same. So I like to think that from this time last year I've um, developed my football a lot and I've also developed my maturity a lot and you know things like vice captain definitely makes a difference um, but to the way I play and the way I like to act just definitely doesn't change. I've been pretty lucky so majority of the new girls I've known um, for quite some time still being pretty young myself and playing youth girls with them um, I've definitely tried to pass on a little bit but these girls have had such great pathways that they're teaching us girls, I'm not going to say us older girls because I'm pretty young, but us girls um, who have had a year experience, they're teaching us just as much. I'd like to just make sure that I just continue to get better and better. I don't want to um, go backwards from the set standard I set last year. And from the team, I think uh, we're very unpredictable um, and there's no surprise that we're going in as the underdog this year. And to me, that excites me. And I think a lot of the girls are sort of thriving off that. So I think we're going to bring something pretty special to the AFLW.